Hello today's video we have the following content. Dot because the scale was too extreme, no one dared to act, and she, who was out of date, came to the rescue, but was unexpectedly promoted to the top actress. In the turbulent and ever-changing stage of the entertainment industry, countless stars have crossed the sky like meteors, some are dazzling, and some are fleeting. And the artists who can maintain their popularity for a long time in this highly competitive circle are undoubtedly those who have gone through thousands of trials and tribulations. Chun Kyon, the queen of idol dramas who is still active on the screen today, is such a typical example. In Chen Kyon's acting career, she has won the love of the audience with many popular idol dramas and has become the ideal heroine in the minds of countless people. However, what is less known is that Chen Kyon's road to fame was not smooth sailing. She also experienced a marginalized and forgotten out-of-date period. However, it was that seemingly low period that made Chen Kyon the radiant today. The story starts with a TV series called Post-It Girl. The original heroine of the show was not Chen Kyon, but because the heroine in the show was set as an unmarried mother, this was a controversial role in the social environment at the time. Many actresses declined the role for fear of affecting their image. Just when the crew was at a loss, Chen Kyon took the initiative to stand up and expressed her willingness to take on the challenge. For Chen Kyon, this opportunity was undoubtedly a huge turning point. At that time, she was at a low point in her career and urgently needed a work to prove herself. Although the role setting the post-it girl was quite controversial, Chen Kyon saw the opportunity in it. She knew that if an actor wanted to gain a foothold in the entertainment industry for a long time, he must dare to break through himself and challenge the unknown. So she resolutely took the role and began her counterattack. After the broadcast of Post-It Girl, Chen Kyon won the recognition of the audience with her superb acting skills and deeply rooted character creation. Her performance made people see the image of a strong and independent woman, and also left a deep impression on her in the hearts of the audience. However, what really made Chen Kyon popular was another drama The Prince Turns Into a Frog. The drama The Prince Turns Into a Frog was very popular at the time and Chen Kyon won the audience's love again with her outstanding performance in the drama. However, unexpectedly, this drama did not make Chen Kyon a first-line actress in one fell swoop. After filming The Prince Turns Into a Frog, Chen Kyon fell into a low period in her career again. There were no new drama appointments and no announcements to appear, and she seemed to be forgotten by the audience again. However, Chen Kyon did not give up. She knew that as an actor, if she wanted to gain a long-term foothold in this circle, she must constantly challenge herself and surpass herself. So, after a period of silence, Chen Kyon stood up again and took on an idol drama called Faded to Love You. The drama Faded to Love You was a sensation at the time, and Chen Kyon won the audience's love again with her wonderful performance in the drama. Her performance made people see a charming female image, and also left an indelible impression on her in the hearts of the audience. This drama not only brought Chen Kyon back to the peak of her career, but also made her the well-deserved queen of idol dramas. Looking back on Chen Kyon's acting career, it is not difficult to find that the reason why she can maintain her popularity in this highly competitive circle for a long time is because she dares to challenge the unknown and break through herself. She has proved a truth with her own strength and talent, only by constantly challenging and surpassing oneself can one gain a foothold on the stage of the entertainment industry. Chen Kyon is now in her 40s, but she still maintains a strong creativity and enthusiasm. She tells us with her own efforts and persistence, no matter how old you are, no matter how many difficulties you encounter, as long as you have dreams and pursuits in your heart, you will definitely be able to create your own glory. Next news. Mo Yu Yun Jian. 30-year-old Jin Lingchen plays the father of 22-year-old Wang Zhengyu, so how can young actors play? Rich second-generation Wu Yanjin complains to Wang Ziwen about being poor. Guli Naz has said it all, instantly revealing the true face of Wang Ziwen's boyfriend. In a previous variety show, according to the program setting, Guli Naz had needed to reveal the name of a celebrity's public partner in the entertainment industry. At the beginning, she accidentally bumped into Wang Ziwen. Naza was probably in a trance for a moment, and her mind worked rapidly for a long time, but she still couldn't remember the name of the other party's boyfriend. She only knew that the other party was a handsome mixed race, so she simply gave such a response. Naz's cute response instantly ignited the atmosphere of the show, making the guests on the scene laugh, and the atmosphere of joy was instantly filled. Although her answer seemed humorous, don't underestimate this short sentence, it actually ensures Wang Ziwen's prosperity and wealth. 
Those who can enjoy the title of ABC are all from prominent families and good backgrounds. However, just as everyone was sending their blessings to Wang Ziwen, the cruel reality dealt her a heavy blow. I remember that in a certain program, Wang Ziwen once inadvertently shared a special gift that Wu Yanjing gave her when she first met him. She was full of expectations, but when she opened the box, all she saw was a necklace decorated with a wooden pendant. It was obvious that the other party seemed to have no memory of the first meeting and never took it to heart. Not to mention that after the two of them started dating, Wu Yanjin seemed to have completely forgotten the existence of the sense of ritual and had never seen her receive his gift. Although Wang Ziwen attributed the problem to the lack of romance in straight men, think deeply, does Wu Yanjin, who grew up in a beautiful country full of vitality and enthusiasm, really lack the romantic skills to please girls? Since being with Wang Ziwen, she has fully integrated into his life, not only carefully selecting clothes, but also cooking delicacies for him personally. Even when meeting with her boyfriend's aunt, she had to face the complaints of their family. Our family is simple and unpretentious. They do not seek to show off, just like him, they are introverted and low-key, never squandering money, and sometimes even look like a master of saving money. Is Wu Yanjin really in poverty? Obviously not. A closer look at Wu Yanjin's way of dealing with people reveals his profound upbringing. This trait is difficult to show without years of careful carving. Let me ask, how much leisure and resources can a family that can only barely raise a poor child have to carefully cultivate their children? Wu Yanjin's skills in the show were outstanding, and his aunt even revealed that his father often generously funded poor students. Such a good deed is admirable. In this context, how can the problem of funds become an obstacle? It can be seen from this that Wu Yanjin is not really poor, but is misled by appearances. Zhou Yan and Wu Yanjin interact closely. Facing Wang Ziwen, Zhou Yan interacted closely with Wu Yanjin. Is this action suggesting that she should break at the right time? The moment when Zhou Yan touched Wu Yanjin's cheek was warmly staged in a certain live reality show. As required by the show, she happened to share her views on Wu Yanjin. Obviously, Zhou Yan has a very high opinion of Wu Yanjin and she gave him full marks without hesitation and praised him without hesitation. While praising him endlessly, she also made small moves secretly, which is really unpredictable. Talking about the exciting moment, Zhou Yan couldn't help but touch Wu Yanjin's cheek, completely forgetting that his partner Wang Ziwen was also present. Indeed, it was not the first time that Zhou Yan was close to Wu Yanjin. There had been similar intimate contacts before. During the previous dinner, Zhou Yan and Zhang Han had a good chat, and the atmosphere was extremely warm. Then, she smiled and gently leaned her head on Wu Yanjin's arms. Wu Yanjin also smiled warmly in response, and didn't think there was anything wrong with such closeness. It is worth mentioning that Zhou Yang's intimate interaction with Wu Yanjin broke through the conventional boundaries between men and women. A major driving force behind this came from the careful setting of the program team. She shouldered a heavy responsibility and needed to complete 10 protection missions, all of which were to protect that important existence Wu Yanjin. Everyone was confused. There were so many ways to complete the task, why did Zhou Yang choose the controversial path alone? Because she did not accurately grasp the scale of interaction between men and women, she was unexpectedly criticized by netizens as a green tea, which aroused public anger. Once, their team had a unique contest with Jer. During that process, Wang Ziwen turned to her boyfriend for comfort because of fear. Unexpectedly, her boyfriend turned around and laughed and played with Zhou Yang, leaving Wang Ziwen alone to face the challenge. Once, Wu Yanjin drove Wang Ziwen, Zhou Yang and Zhang Han out together, and Wang Ziwen seemed to be lost in thought after getting in the car, and her overall state seemed relatively low. However, Wu Yanjin did not seem to catch his girlfriend's strange expression. Instead, he chatted with Zhou Yang in the back seat, making her laugh. Such scenes are frequently presented in the program and are not uncommon. Whether it is a gentle interaction of touching the head or the silent protection on the single plank bridge, Wu Yanjin's enthusiasm for Zhou Yan is always generous and consistent. Although he is Wang Ziwen's boyfriend, he unexpectedly puts Wang Ziwen on the edge between him and Zhou Yan, as if he has become a bystander. Is this way of getting along really reasonable? This can't help but make people doubt. Indeed, Zhou Yang's enthusiastic behavior towards Wu Yanjin may be largely due to the arrangement and requirements of the program team. However, the man failed to keep the necessary distance from the opposite sex, but instead showed a self-satisfied attitude, which is really puzzling. In any case, he has already started a family and career. Even if he Zhou Yang approaches him, he doesn't have to be so happy, let alone difficult to refuse.
As expected, the overly intimate behavior of the two quickly attracted strong criticism and criticism from the majority of netizens. Joey Young, once a shining star in the music industry, is now simply labeled as T-Sister, and it seems to be particularly difficult to get rid of this negative impression. Another possibility is that Joey Young may want to imitate Kwasi Oxio's style of doing things to help Wang Ziwen see through the true face of the scumbag, and such a motive is not impossible. Joey Young spends Father's Day with her boss. To celebrate Father's Day with a sponsor worth 11 billion, Joey Young chose to accompany this important sponsor and temporarily put aside the reunion with her biological father. In June 2013, the queen of the music industry, Joey Young, revealed her unique plan for her birthday this year in an interview. On the occasion of her birthday, which happened to be Father's Day, she planned to celebrate her birthday with her mother during the day, and have dinner with her boss Yang Xiaocheng when night fell to celebrate Father's Day. Once Joey Yang's schedule was announced, it triggered widespread heated discussions. She chose to spend Father's Day with her boss who was involved in scandals instead of with her father. This choice seemed extremely inappropriate and obviously violated common sense and human feelings. Little did we know that there were more shocking things waiting for us. It is rumored that Joey Yang was asked by her father to borrow money in her early years, but she decisively refused and did not give her father any financial support. How could a queen of many years not have such financial resources? Is it really because she is short of money and difficult to raise funds? Obviously not. Back then, Joey Yang presented a shocking 19 concert feasts in the Hong Kong Coliseum. In order to repay the love of fans, she tried her best in every concert, even performing overtime, and was willing to stop until after 12 o'clock in the middle of the night, just to make the fans' experience more perfect. Because of this unscrupulous willfulness, we suffered a delay fine of up to 1 million, which was a heavy price. Not only that, Joey Yang trusted Li Yu Hei along, who had only been dating for two and a half years, not only allowing him to enter and exit her mansion worth half a billion yuan at will, but also generously gave up her million dollar push for her boyfriend's daily travel. However, facing her biological father, Wang Jin Hu, she chose to give up her feelings and cut off all contact with her. People can't help but wonder, since Joey Yang can show such generosity to strangers, why is she so cold to her biological father? In fact, the reason is obvious. The other party's behavior makes her deeply disappointed and her heart is full of chill. Joey Yang was born in an ordinary family. Her mother worked hard, while her father was addicted to gambling and had an unruly personality. When Joey Yang was only 15 years old, her father resolutely parted ways with her mother. After receiving the divorce certificate, he left, leaving a pair of children to be raised by her mother alone. In order to support the family's livelihood, her mother resolutely chose to go out to work for her sister. In order to take care of the young Joey Yang and her sister more conveniently, she decided to put the children in a simple cardboard box. Only in this way can she balance work and take care of them, and achieve both. It can be said that Joey Yang often faced the dilemma of not having enough food in her childhood, and she often worried about the next meal after eating this one. She finally gained a foothold in the music industry with her talent, and the father who had not asked about the mother and her two children for more than 10 years suddenly appeared as if he had smelled something. The other party repeatedly asked her to help repay the debt, and even hung Joey Yang's autograph poster in the pornographic bar in an attempt to attract customers. The latter tolerated all this for a long time, until a large portrait of her father was posted on the street to collect debts, and her father even intensified his demands for money. She finally decided to completely sever ties with her biological father. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel,